Good morning, breaking news right now. A massive water main break has shut down several major roads and hundreds are waking up with little or no running water right now. This is one of the largest diameter high pressure pipeline projects in Nashville Metro's history. The project uh, was comprised of a combination of 60 inch diameter and 36 inch diameter pipe. The previous breaks that occurred at uh, McGavick Pike made it apparent to Metro that they wanted to have more reliability in their system and so they were able to do this with a little over five miles of an inner type pipeline instead of adding lots of other infrastructure. So this was the most economic solution to provide those benefits of reliability, redundancy, and system-wide flexibility. Being able to isolate components would allow either treatment plant to provide that water and still maintain pressure and delivery capacity throughout the entire metro water system. Major problem with the tying into the existing pipeline was that we were tying into unrestrained pipe the project incorporated a large thrust block tied into rock and prevented the, the pipe from moving. This restraint system had to withstand approximately a million pounds of thrust. Trying to place that into the ground that has already been filled with other utilities. You're talking gas lines, sewer lines, water lines. And here we are coming with our 60-inch ductile iron pipe trying to make a way for us to get from Elm Hill Pike to Lebanon Pike. We also had a moving construction zone. Our construction zone was roughly around 400 to 500 feet. As we laid the pipe and backfilled and put on a temporary binder, we were able to move down the road, opening up the lanes behind us. Without this project, Metro Water would still have their single line across the Stones River into the eastern portion of the distribution system but it would be a volatile situation for those customers. So this project allows them flexibility. They can push water off the 36 inch across Stones River and bring it back on the new 36 inch in our project and back into the system. The inner tie provides basically a loop which reduced water age, so it really kind of tied everything together. The primary reason for having an expedited schedule was to save cost and then also to work with TDOT to mitigate impact traffic since this is such an important way to get from East Nashville to downtown. As a result of the project, not only does Nashville Metro have improved reliability and redundancy in their water system, they also provide a greater benefit to the community as a whole.